You are relaxing on the couch when suddenly everything begins to shake. Pictures fall off the wall and glasses rattle in the cabinet. Just as suddenly, the shaking stops. You have just survived an earthquake. You were lucky. This earthquake was minor. Earthquakes can be very powerful. This incredible force of nature can destroy whole cities and endanger human lives. An earthquake is the Earth's way of releasing stress. Earthquakes usually happen along fault lines. Fault lines are places on Earth where rocks slide past each other. This usually happens at the edge of a tectonic plate. There are about 20 tectonic plates along Earth's surface that constantly move in different directions. As these plates move, they cause the Earth's crust to shift and break. When the crust breaks, waves of energy are released. These waves move through the Earth and can be felt as earthquakes. Over a million earthquakes are reported worldwide each year. Most of them are weak and last less than a minute. Some of them are strong and cause damage. Most earthquakes happen at fault lines where tectonic plates meet. California has a lot of earthquakes because it is on a fault line. The east coast of the United States doesn't have many earthquakes, but they are still possible. Scientists cannot predict when an earthquake will happen. If they could, many lives would be saved. However, scientists can measure the strength of an earthquake while it is happening. They use an instrument called a seismograph to do this. A seismograph records the shaking of the earth by drawing lines on paper. The longer the lines, the stronger the earthquake. The strength or magnitude of an earthquake is recorded using the Richter scale. The strongest earthquake ever recorded scored a 9.5 on the Richter scale in Chile in 1960. This video was created by La Fontaine of Knowledge. Click the link in the description for lesson materials that go along with the video. And subscribe to my channel for more videos like this.